Hey, it's your girl Amber Rose for the Dub Magazine Project. The Dub Magazine Project. Family means the most to me. Ride shotgun with the stars. We are the Far East Movement. Find out what they drive. I'm the biggest boss in this business. And what drives them. It's not about me. At no time is it really about me. Dog Magazine Project. Shout outs. Block. Welcome to the Dub Magazine Project. I'm your host, Gang. This is an insider's look into the world of celebs and their cars. Today, I'm hosting our final episode from the Dub Garage. Later on in the show, we're finally going to reveal that Ford Mustang that the Dub team has been working on all season. So check it. When you date two of the biggest rappers in the world, you're going to get loads of attention. But Amber Rose is standing on her own two feet and inspiring others to get out there and make a name for themselves. Check this. I have real breasts. I have a real butt. <laughs> you know, I don't have any plastic surgery or anything to enhance my beauty. I represent women, natural, beautiful women. When I was really, really young, I was a big, big dork. I had glasses since I was five. I wanted to be a marine biologist. I just wanted to go like swim with whales and like study them, and that's what I really wanted to do, but my life took a different turn. When I was 20, I got approached by a woman that works for Def Jam, and she said I should be in music videos. So I was like, nah, 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 I don't want to do music videos. And then I, I flew out and I did my first video. Even though it doesn't seem like it, I'm really just starting off with like my own brand. I'm a model and entrepreneur. I'm just working really, really hard. A lot of photo shoots, a red carpet events. I'm working on a movie, a very, very busy girl. I went from urban model to high fashion model. I've done both and I don't starve myself. I eat pretty much whatever I want, I work out. I try to be healthy, even though I'm a smoker. I have like a full glam squad that keeps me looking pretty all the time. And then we're gonna put this inside, obviously, the high uh, yeah. Hello. Hi, honey, how are you? My boyfriend, you know, he always says, babe, the only thing that matters is that you have, you have people that love you. So the people that don't understand or they hate or they judge you, it doesn't matter. This life, it kind of was handed to me on a silver platter. You know, and I know there's a lot of girls out there that are really, really trying to, to, to get where I'm at. It's been really, really hard to constantly explain myself and where I come from and my struggles in life and what I've been through. I grew up in the hood. I grew up very poor, poverty stricken when I had the opportunity to get my mom out of that neighborhood where I grew up, that's when I was really, really happy that this life can, can get my mom out of there. I want to get married and have babies. I want to be a wife and a mom. I like the fact that I always have something to do, so that's fun. And everything I do is fun. I always enjoy myself. I just want to do the right thing with my fame, and I want to be an inspiration to people. 